Good morning YouTube, this is your boy Taticolator coming at you again with another video. And it is about 6.20 a.m. and you know what time it is? It's time to go game hunting. But today, I'm with my boy Sean. We're going to go hit up a 15 mile long yard sale. But before then, check out the footage from earlier in the week. You ready? Let's go! Now you got rid of the 20, did Yeah, now I got rid of it. <laughs> Alright folks, we're going to go into Bethesda gift shop, gift some thrift. Never been in here before. Let's check it out. Okay folks, so just left that thrift store, picked up Bass Pro Shops The Strike, complete on the Wii, BMX Triple X on the Xbox, disc and case only, and Medal of Honor Frontline Platinum Hits Xbox, disc and case only. Alright, on to the next. Alright folks, we're back at Linden Bear, let's go in and take a look. Folks, are just leaving Linden Bear and picked up the Matrix Path of Neo on the Xbox Complete and Amped only on Xbox Complete for two dollars each. On to the next. All right. All right, folks, let's go into this pawn shop and take a look. Okay folks, so just walked out of that pawn shop and I scored LA Noir Complete Dead or Alive 5 Complete Battleship Complete and Grid 2 Complete Charge me three bucks a piece on to the next Alright folks, meeting up with this kid to pick up some PlayStation 3 games. Hello. Hello. So what you got? You want to put them back here on the bed of the truck yeah. and let me look? Come on. That'd be alright? Yeah. You know, I just feel kind of like shit so crazy. So I have to do it. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, that's not a problem at all. <laughs> the reason we're doing this is because I haven't played it in six months. He got a PS4. PS4? Yeah. yeah, a lot of people get rid of their old stuff, but I'm, I'm a collector, so it's going to a good home. Yeah. <laughs> you see, I collected a bunch of them. Yeah, you got some good titles some here. Of the ones that I got were actually broken. But, yeah. but he uh, left the ones that didn't work at home. Yeah. See, we have more than just the original Assassin's Creed. Yeah. Yeah, this is one of these two are my favorite games. I'm hoping they have them on. I know they have a remastered version of this, but I'm hoping on getting them. Yeah. This one. We checked to see if they all had. Is um. 
Well, he needs to check too. Yeah. Uh, all six of the first Star Wars movies. Oh, Lego. cool. That's cool. Lego. But yeah. it's just not the. Because the person who gave it oh. turned it in. What? I thought I had that one. <laughs> Must be at home. One. I it's forgot right. to check that one. I forgot to check that one. Sorry. Alright, so those. Sorry, man. That's alright. That's the only one I didn't check. Well, you'll, you'll that have to pay $2 off of it, Zeke. Oh, yeah. I checked the magic. And actually, I don't even collect sports titles. So, that one I'm going to leave with you as well. Okay. Right. Yeah, I just, I've never been into sports games. I like stuff like Assassin's Creed. That's my style. And it just got bought more yeah. over the weekend for the PS4, and that's what he's playing. Yeah. Okay, so we got one, two, three, that would be five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Wait, I think the, I think this one. That's still 15 games right there. Oh, okay. There so was 17 all together, oh, so. He accidentally put the ones that he didn't want. Okay. I got so here's, here's 30. Okay. Bad. Yeah, um, let me, let me recount that. I think that. the one, game for this one is actually going to be like 4. Five, okay, six, we could seven, eight, eight yeah. nine, ten, okay, the eleven, game, the game, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay. Yeah. All right. Cool. Yeah. I appreciate it. You appreciate it. All right, folks. Let's go into Average Joe's Pawn and Gun and take a look. All right, folks. So just leaving the pawn shop, and I picked up Diablo and Bladestorm on the PS3 for four bucks each. On to the next. Okay, folks, so when I came in here yesterday, he told me they were liquidating and trying to sell everything out. Let's see if I can't score something cheap again today. Okay, folks, so we're just walking out of the pawn shop and I got all of this for $22. Told him that's all I had cash, he took it. And they're all complete. We got Stuntman Ignition, Payday 2, Split Second, Rogue Warrior, Front Mission Evolved, Dynasty Warrior Strike Force. SSX and Lair and he gave me Super New Super Mario Brothers 2 on the 3DS it's just the case and manual and an empty PS3 case for free not bad on to the next you know we gotta hit up that ATM grab some cash can't go to yard sales without hitting up the ATM Are you serious? Yeah. Dang, coming. <laughs> okay, well, that ATM was bust. So, we gotta go hit up the bank. <laughs> you know we gotta fuel up on that coffee before we go? What better place than that McDonald's coffee? I swear if I spill some in my lap, I'm suing for like a billion dollars. Okay folks, so we are on the road that this 15 mile long yard sale is supposed to be on. But it is five minutes till seven. And so we're gonna keep our eyes peeled. All right, on to the next. 
It's not video game related, folks, but Cabbage Patch Kids? <laughs> That's pretty cool right there. It's an old TV tray for a quarter. Pretty cool. Okay. Let's take a look. You buy all, all consoles like the Wii and the controller. Yes, sir. Absolutely. Yep. So if you get your phone in, if you give him his, your phone number, sure. so he can call you, then he get. His stuff's in a, a room that uh -huh. we can't even walk in right now. Okay. But he's got a ton of Wii stuff. Sure. If you give him the phone number when he calls you, oh, yeah. uh, we'll give you a shot. And absolutely. You know what we got. Sure, absolutely. Uh, what you want on these three? Just making an offer. We got no idea. I usually do about $2 a piece on PS3. Six bucks? Okay. You got change for a 20? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Let's see you well, you gonna take those or you don't want those? No, I don't collect sports. Yeah. Um. No. We was gonna turn his other, trade his other one in, and they said we'll give you fifteen bucks for it for the console. I said, no, I better not do that. Yeah. <laughs> Type this phone number in your phone. Fourteen. That was four. Take it. Really? I'm sorry. <laughs> I need a ten, please. Thank you. You need a ten. <laughs> Okay folks, so just scored my first video game score of the day and picked up Spider-Man Shattered Dimensions, Mortal Kombat Complete Edition, and Sniper Elite V2 on the PS3 for $2 a piece. On to the next. Okay, so I didn't get this on video because it was a real quick in and out. But stopped alongside the road, found an ALF doll for a dollar. He's a big alpha doll too. <laughs> All right, on to the next. Connect Adventures for 50 cents. Cool. Okay, folks, so I'm sitting here trying to teach my boy about what to look out for when you're going to yard sales. And this is definitely an item to look out for because it sells very well and it goes for a good penny. So, Show the folks what you got. Got the Rosetta Stone, Espanol, headsets, $5. $5 for the headset and the program. That's at least $50 or more. Pre-owned. On to the new. next. Brand new, never touched headset. <laughs> Brand new, never touched headset. Pre-owned program. Complete. Complete. Score. <laughs> <laughs> On to the next. Okay, folks. Totally forgot to turn my camera on for this but it's not that big of a score. Uh, got some Wii games, two nunchucks, and a Wii moat for a dollar each. We got Wii Fit Plus complete, Minute to Win It complete, Game Party 3 complete, The Biggest Loser complete, and Ray, uh, Rayman Raving Rabbits 2 complete, plus the Wii moat, and two nunchucks dollar each so seven dollars spent not a bad deal on to the next there you go thank you Okay, folks, so just came up on that slim PS2 lot. He wanted $50 for the system in the games, and they were all sports titles. I passed, but I did come across Wii Sports, and I picked that up for a buck. Always pick up your Wii Sports. They're still selling anywhere between $11 to $15. All right, on to the next. Yeah, you can see it. Yeah, you can see it. Yeah, it works. 
Got any more video games? Uh, oh, it looks like there's some down here. What you got in the house? Water. I'll bring like you from around Oh, you've got them inside? I'm, I'm from Blackshear. Blackshear. Yeah. I have, we have yard help you know, all the time. Okay. I'll have my gun up with you. Hey, matter? Make sure them things is in there now. Oh, I did. There's yeah. one in, in this one and these here. There ain't nothing in there. Yeah. Uh, that's yeah. a couple of bucks. Yeah. Crap. I don't what know. What we do, we buy these things for the month, you know, and I don't have time yeah. to go through them and open them up, see if they're in there or whatnot. Well, what would you want for these? Yeah. Six bucks. Six bucks. Six Take six four? Six. A dollar a piece? Oh, uh, two dollars. Oh, wait a minute. Two, four, six, eight bucks. Eight bucks? Yeah. How you doing? Good. Do you do six? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I do six. Yeah. Okay, folks. So just picked up some stuff for six dollars. Got Super Smash Brother 3DS case, but inside is a DS game missing its label. So there's no telling what, what that is. But... We got the case for Super Smash on the 3DS now. And then I picked up Wally. Tony Hawk's down downhill jam. And Guitar Hero 5 disc only. On to the next. Nope. Those two. You can. I'll do a dollar on them too. If you okay. buy all of these. Well, let me see what you got there first. Right. I'm making sure right, there's these. Got it. Right. That's a movie. That one. Got it. That yeah, one. Yeah, Tiger Woods. That'll find. This one, this one, this Condition. one, and this one, all of these. You got these, you said? I already got okay. those. Rita, I had to come right here and help this customer real quick. Oh, hold on, I'll be right back. Yes, yes sir. I mean, yes, ma'am. Bad scratched. I'll pass on that one. Ooh, bad condition. Bad, bad, bad condition. That scratched a heck of that. I 
good condition. I'll take that one. How much you want on this? Two dollars. Two dollars. Coming right up. Thank you. Do you need a bag for me? Uh, I'll be alright. Can you show me? Yeah, my car's right there. Oh, All right, folks, picking up these loose discs here for a dollar each. Uh, I got one more. He likes two more years. <laughs> I'll just get it all graduated something for fun. Yeah. That's why we need the location on the train. Okay, folks, so it's about 10.45 a.m. We've been at it for about three and a half hours or so. And uh, score some, some video games, nothing too high end though, but I didn't spend more than two dollars for a game all day. Uh, but the day's not over, the morning's not over. We're gonna hit up a few more sales before we go into work. On to the next, all right. Let's go into the Linda Bear and take a look. <laughs> Spider. What you want on them? Do dollar each. Yeah, sorry. Okay, cool. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Alright folks, and that's why you always ask, hey, you got any old video games you don't want to play anymore? Because you never know when somebody's going to bring out Super Nintendo games. And I scored Battletoads Double Dragon for a dollar. Heck yes. On to the next. What you asking for everything? For the whole, for all of this, there. For all of it. 65. 65? What about just per game? $2 a game. $2 a game? Okay. I don't have that one.
All right, I'm gonna take these four right here. Four? Yeah. Okay, folks, wow, we have had a huge week again. I think we're gonna call this PS3 week because I have scored a ton of PS3. Now, if you don't know, <laughs> PS3 is super cheap to collect for right now, so go ahead and jump on that bandwagon. These are gonna be in no particular order, but I'm gonna go ahead and start with stuff that I did not catch on video. So, I got three games uh, from a friend of mine that I did not catch on video, so you won't see this in the live pickups. But I've got Saw 2 Flesh and Blood Complete, Rapala Fishing Frenzy 2009 Complete, Pick Up Your Rapala Games, they usually hold good value, and Splatterhouse. Disc and case only. All right. Then we've got Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing. Disc and case only, and that disc is backwards. There it is. Disc only Star War Lego Star Wars: The Complete Saga. We've got the combo pack. Call of Duty Black Ops and Black Ops 2. No manual. Assassin's Creed Rogue. No manual. Lego Batman. No manual. Star Wars The Clone Wars Republic Heroes. Oh wow, all these are backwards. No manual. Call of Duty World at War. No manual. This kid had like 15 games. Only one of them had a manual. Call of Duty Ghost. No manual. Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare. No manual. And it's also the greatest hits, greatest hits disc inside the black label case. So that's all janked up right there. Another good title to look out for is, believe it or not, Lego Jurassic World, but it is disc only, disc in case, Grand Theft Auto 5 Greatest Hits, disc and case. Alright, then moving on, and I can't even really remember at this point, I've gone to so many yard sales and so many pickups this week uh actually yeah i do remember this all came from one pawn shop and they are liquidating their video games actually they're liquidating their entire store they're going out of business so i was able to pick up all of these for two dollars two or three dollars i think it was two dollars anyway we got lair complete Move some of this off to the side. We got Diablo 3 complete. Payday 2 complete. Front Mission Evolved complete. Also from that kid was Lego Star Wars 3. Disc and case only. Then back to the pawn shop pickups was Dead or Alive 5. Complete. Grid 2. Complete. L.A. Noir. Complete. Stuntman Ignition. Complete. Dynasty Warriors Strike Force. Complete. Blade Storm. Complete. Rogue Warrior. Complete. Split Second. Complete. SSX. Complete. C 
see a trend here. WRC World Rally Championship 4. Just disc and case. Battleship. Complete. Also from that kid was Minecraft. The PS3 version. Disc and case only. Also from that kid was Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens. This was the complete game. Um, then today at the yard sales, I picked up three PS3 games. Unfortunately, I'm only going to be able to show you two because I left one in Sean's car. And uh, you got to see a little bit of Sean earlier today. But it's Mortal Kombat Complete Edition. Uh, greatest Hits Complete. Spider-Man Shattered Dimensions, complete. Be on the lookout for your Spider-Man games on the PS3. They hold value, good value, $20 or more. All right, that is going to do it for the PS3s. There was a ton of PS3 stuff. But I paid no more than 2 3 bucks a piece. All right, also in um, Coastal Pond, for $8, I picked up Persona 4 Arena Ultimax. It was just a uh, disc and case only. And you can see total due from customer there. Eight bucks. At uh, Lending Bear, I picked up Amped. And it was complete. And there's the receipts. Pay two dollars each for these, and the Matrix Path of Neo complete. Also two dollars from Lending Bear. Then from a local store, I was actually watching Metal Jesus Rock's new video with. Uh, Radical Reggie, and they were going over PlayStation 2 gems. Well, Radical Reggie mentioned Tokobot Plus, and my local uh, store had it for $1.99, so I definitely went ahead and picked it up, but it is disc and case only. And then from Thrift Store, I picked up Bass Pro Shops The Strike Complete on the Wii BMX Triple X on the original Xbox Disc and Case Only And Medal of Honor Frontline Platinum Hits Disc and Case Only Getting into more of today's yard sale scores I picked up Wally on the DS Complete. Tony Hawk's Downhill Jam on the Wii. Disc and case only. Guitar Hero 5 for the PS3. Disc only. And you saw this. This is just an empty case. And it has got some DS game. I don't know what it is. But, how about I go grab a DS and we'll find out. Okay, so I have inserted the disc with no label into the DSi Excel. And it is... Come on. Here we go. Look at that glare. Look at that reflection. Come on. It's a Disney game. Toy Story 3. So we got Toy Story 3, no label on the DS, with an empty Super Smash Brothers or Nintendo 3DS case. Then for a dollar each, I picked up the following 
We stuff. Dollar for the nunchuck. Dollar for the nunchuck. Dollar for the Wiimote. Dollar for Wii Fit Plus. Complete. Dollar for Minute to Win It. Complete. A dollar for Raymond Raving Rabbits 2. Complete. A dollar for The Biggest Loser. Complete. And a dollar for Game Party 3. Complete. So I paid $7 at that uh, yard sale. Unfortunately, I forgot to turn my camera on and pick up that live video shot. But you saw me in the car afterwards. And um, yeah, so I got all of those for a dollar. And then for a dollar each, I picked up Dissidia Final Fantasy on the PSP. Complete. And a dollar for NBA 08 on the PSP factory sealed. So that'll just stay sealed forever. Also for a dollar, picked up Eternal Ring on the PS2. For a dollar, picked up Star Wars Battlefront Greatest Hits on the PS2. Picked up Reckless the Yakuza Missions disc only on the PS2 for a dollar. And then for a dollar each, I believe it was a dollar each, can't remember. Picked up Yu-Gi-Oh! The False Bound Kingdom on the GameCube, disc only. And stacked on the PS2, disc only. For 50 cents, picked up Connect Adventures, which, you know, for 50 cents, I'm okay with that. This game doesn't go for much anyway, but for 50 cents, why not? It was complete. Then for a dollar, I picked up Wii Sports. I always pick up Wii Sports. Now this kid had a PS2 system and some PS2 sports titles and Wii Sports thrown in all together. He wanted uh, 50 bucks was the lowest he would go on the PS2 games and the PS2 uh, Slim system. I'm I'm never paying fifty dollars for a PS2 Slim ever, and uh, so I asked him, you know, how much you just want on the Wii Sports? I was like, will you take a dollar? He's like, okay, cool. Then I paid two dollars for Greatest Hits Marvel Ultimate Alliance Special Edition, and it was complete. And paid two dollars for Greatest Hits Star Wars Episode Three: Revenge of the Sith at the pawn shop and it was complete. I also picked up some non-gaming items. SpongeBob SquarePants 4 gigabyte USB flash drive, brand new, still sealed. Now this was selling at Walgreens at one time for $17.49 and then it was reduced to $8.79. I don't know if you can see that. But for a buck, can't beat it. Also for a dollar, I got Marvel Avengers 4 gigabyte, 4 gigabyte flash drive. Still sealed in its package. That's pretty cool. For a dollar, I picked up the 18 inch Hawaiian shirt ALF doll. And if you don't remember who Alf is, you're too young. <laughs> um, Alf was a very popular TV show back in the, I want to say late 80s, early 90s. And um, Alf stands for Alien Life Form. And it was about Alf. And he was an alien that lived with uh, a human family on Earth. And it was, it was really entertaining. It was a really funny show. Um, this goes for about $20, $25. Picked it up for a buck. Also, I pick up anytime I see these. These are vintage metal TV trays. 
And I've actually got the 89 Batman and the Batman Returns TV tray up here in my kitchen. Um, I paid a quarter for this. I don't know if you can see the 25 cent sticker, but I paid a quarter for this and this goes for about 18 to 20 dollars all the way up to 25 dollars depending on condition and this is in fantastic condition um it is cabbage patch kids so i saw that and snatched it right up all right then i've got some loose disc here and i paid a dollar each for these um all of them are in really good condition We've got the new Super Mario Brothers Wii, Dark Alliance on the PS2. You might hear my dog back there in the background. We got Tekken 2 on the PlayStation 1, Bubsy 3D on the PS1, Dark Cloud Greatest Hits on the PS2, and Dark Cloud 2. Black Label PS2. All right, and then I've got more. Got a package in today, and this was from an offer up deal. Paid $5 for Silent Hill 2, and it is disc only. Uh, so not a bad score there for five bucks Then I picked up Driven PS2 complete Gran Turismo 3 a spec greatest hits complete These four games are in really nice condition even though they don't go for much, they're in still re really good condition. We got iToy Anti-Grav on the PS2 Complete. And Mercury Meltdown Remix Complete. And then I saved the best for last. Because this was the score of the day. So... Always, always, always ask folks if people have old video games that they don't want. So I go up to this yard sale. It was a community yard sale in this subdivision. And there were about five or six different yard sales within this one street block. Uh, it was one way in, one way out. And started this house. I didn't see any video games. So I just simply asked, hey, do you have any old video games that you're not playing anymore? And she said... No? Well, I've got some old Super Nintendo stuff. I was like, okay. My eyes perked up and my, my tail started wagging. I was like, what you got? She's like, I said, well, uh, you know, if you go in and grab what you can, I'll make you an offer. So she goes in, she's back within seconds, and she comes out with two games. And uh, so I'm looking at them, and... I said, well, what, what would you want? What do you want for him? She said, I don't know. Make me an offer. I said, how about a dollar each? She said, okay. So I picked up Speedy Gonzalez, Los Gatos Banditos. And the cool thing about these games is they still have the covers on them. And the score of the day was Battle Toads Double Dragon for a dollar can't beat it folks you can't beat it and it's got the cover and it's in immaculate condition and the label is pristine there is no scuffing on it it looks fantastic I'm I don't even have to clean it I've already tested it it works beautifully so there you have it folks there is the week it has been one heck of a week Definitely one heck of a week for PS3. While you can, go ahead and start snatching up all your PS3. Uh, it's going pretty cheap right now. I didn't pay any more than $3 per game on any of them. A lot of them I got for $2 each. And uh, yeah, there you have it. 
All right, folks, if you've enjoyed this content, please leave a thumbs up. Leave a comment below. Let me know how I'm doing. And if you haven't subscribed yet, by all means, hit that subscribe button. While you're at it, hit the little bell icon next to it. When you do, you're going to receive a notification every single time I upload new content. All right, folks, I've had a great week. I hope you're doing the same. I'm Tata Collector, and have a good one.